The Life and Sad Ending of Jennifer Holliday Jennifer Holliday was born Jennifer Yvette Holliday on October 19, 1965, in Houston, Texas, U.S. Holliday has been married twice. In March 1991, just two months after she met keyboardist Billy Meadows in a nightclub where she was singing. Her second marriage, which began on March 21, 1993, and ended in 1994, was to Reverend Andre Woods, a minister in Detroit. Jet Magazine covered the marriage in their April 19, 1993 issue. Holiday landed her first big role on Broadway in 1979 at age 13, the same day she auditioned for the Broadway production of Your Arms Too Short to Box with God. Her performance in that musical earned her a 1981 Drama Desk nomination. Her next role, which she began to act at 16, was the role for which she became best known, the role of Effie Melody White in the Broadway musical Dreamgirls. Holiday originated the role of Effie and remained with the show for nearly four years after its December 20, 1981 opening. Her performance in the role was widely acclaimed, particularly in her iconic performance of the musical number that ends Act 1, and I am telling you I am not going. Among the acclaim was Holiday's sweep of awards in 1982, including the Tony Award for Best Leading Actress in a Musical, a Grammy Award for her recorded version of the song, and Drama Desk and Theatre World Awards for her acting performance. Holiday also performed in the touring company of Sing, Mahalia, Sing in 1985. In 1998, Holiday was featured on the album, My Favorite Broadway Ladies as one of the queens of Broadway. Holiday's version of the song And I Am Telling You I Am Not Going made her a star on Broadway and catapulted her to national stardom. In 1982, a pop version of the song was released as a single. The song became successful, peaking at number one on the Billboard R&B chart, and number 22 on the Billboard Hot 100. She continued to have success as a recording artist through the rest of the decade. Her follow-up song, I Am Love, became another hit in 1983. Holiday's later R&B hits included Hard Time for Lovers, No Frills Love, I Am On Your Side and A Woman's Got the Power. A Woman's Got the Power charted at top 7 in summer of 1999. It recharted the following year, peaking at top 1. She continued to appear on the charts throughout the 1990s but never had the same level of success she had in the 1980s. Holiday was a featured vocalist on the number one single I Want to Know What Love Is by Foreigner in 1985. A number of her songs became hits on the U.S. dance charts as well. A dance version of And I Am Telling You I Am Not Going peaked at the top six on the Hot Dance Music Club Play chart in 2001. Ms. Holiday's performance and Simon's long-term repertoire of gospel-influenced songbooks Bridge, Gone at Last, Slip Slidin' Away, and Loves Me Like a Rock is the glue that holds the show together. Visually intriguing is the role reversal of a larger-than-life Jennifer Holiday and a waif-thin Luther Vandross. The music, however, is uniformly exciting, mesmerizing, and sets the highest of high standard for gospel arrangements. You will seldom see a major gospel show without a musical reference to this concert's arrangements. Holiday became popular with LGBT events and fundraisers, which she acknowledged on her gospel album On and On. Because of this, the Atlantic Entertainment Group's director of live talent, Scott Sherman, produced and promoted many Jennifer Holiday events for several years, acting as both Holiday's de facto agent and as her road manager. Under Sherman's aegis, Holiday went on a series of special tours and promotions, one-night-only performances, LGBT pride appearances, and special fundraising events. In the 1990s, Holiday lost a substantial amount of weight and talked about her health struggles with depression during promotional interviews. Initially, the weight loss was attained strictly by diet. Eventually, in an effort to avoid regaining the weight, Holiday had gastric bypass surgery. 
After the initial weight loss, she released an LP and video titled I'm On Your Side. The video, unlike most videos, was recorded live. In 1995, Holiday released the gospel album On and On. In a March 2008 interview, she revealed that she was in the studio working on a new album, to be released later that year. In April 2011, Holiday released a Christian CD titled Goodness and Mercy on her own Euphonic Records label. She produced it in conjunction and cooperation with the Reverend Raphael G. Warnock. On June 26, 2007, Holiday made a surprise appearance at the Bet Awards, singing And I Am Telling You I Am Not Going in a duet with Jennifer Hudson, who had played Effie White in the 2006 film adaptation of Dreamgirls and won an Oscar for her performance. On May 23, 2012, Holiday performed And I Am Telling You I Am Not Going alongside American Idol finalist Jessica Sanchez during the American Idol Season 11 finale. On October 2, 2018, Holiday surprised the seven-year-old viral singing sensation, Malia Emma Tiandra Wajaja on GMA Day, and they performed a duet of And I Am Telling You I Am Not Going. On June 25, 2019, the New York Times Magazine listed Jennifer Holiday among hundreds of artists whose material was reportedly destroyed in the 2008 Universal Fire. Jennifer Holliday's experience was tough and full of challenges that made her stronger than ever. Thanks for what she has brought.